Good morning and thanks for joining me again today. It is Thursday the 8th of September and for breakfast this morning I have got overnight oats. So in here there are 40 grams of oats from a healthy extra B and then I've put one of the vanilla protein yogurts from Aldi's for one and a half sins and there's a pile of frozen raspberries which now have defrosted and made a nice juice in there so Sorry about the lighting, it's so dark this morning in here. Uh, yeah, so I made this last night, I've just given it a good stir. So this is uh, my Healthy Extra B, one and a half sins and speed. This is my lunch today. I've got two slices of, no I haven't, I've got three slices of bacon medallion. So I usually have two, but I fancy three. So they are free on the Slimmer World Plan. I've got two poached eggs, they are also free and protein. And then I've got some cherry tomatoes and mushrooms for speed. So I've had a super busy morning, all morning, so I'm really looking forward to this now. And I'll show you if I have anything else. So I'm going to have the same for my pudding again today. So I've got a large orange for a speed food. And it's banana and custard Muller light yogurt. I've opened it because this one is... A couple of days out of date so I just wanted to make sure it's okay which it is so so yeah so that is speed food and my yogurt is half a sin so I'm just having a coffee and I'm fancying something so I'm gonna have this hi-fi bar which I'll have to sing so I've had, had my healthy extra B so this is three sin I've just made this Slimming World roulade so it's all in the tin ready for the oven so once it's done I shall show you the finished result so that's the roulade out of the oven now. So I'm just going to leave it cool and then I will fill it and show you what I've done. With it. So whilst the roulade is cooling, I've uh, started to prepare our tea. So we're having one of the JD seasonings. I never know how to pronounce this. For yita. Um, yeah. So we got I got peppers, onions, chicken, and that spice mix in there. So that's all going to brown off nicely. So I've put the quark in here now and it's got a bit of sweetener uh, mixed into the quark and then I've just chopped some strawberries up to go inside. So that's the finished result. I've just cut it in half and then I'm just going to store it in um, one of these containers to go in the fridge. So yeah, so it was just four eggs separated. And then you whisk the egg whites until you get stiff peaks. Then in the yolks you have um, two tablespoons, no sorry, four tablespoons of cork. And if you want to put vanilla essence or sweetener or whatever like that in there, I just put some vanilla essence. And then you fold in the yolk mixture into the whites. And then you put it into like a Swiss roll tin like this. Um, and then that's that. And then when it's cool, you use the rest of the tub of the cork. I had a 250 gram tub. And then in there, you put in whatever flavouring. Some people put hot options, hot chocolate powder, and which obviously makes the sins then start going up. So I just put in a tablespoon of sweetener. Um, which I'm not going to sin, and then obviously the strawberries. So that should do probably four servings, I would imagine. So it's going to be sin free because all that was in there was one tablespoon of the sweetener. And when I have it, I will serve it with like lots of fruit, lots of berries, or something. So I've just put some rice pudding on in the slow cooker. So there's 114 grams of uh, pudding rice in here and that is sin free and then there's a whole carton of this milk in there. Um, I'll confirm on the screen what the allowance is as I can't remember and then I just put a cap full of this in just to sweeten it a bit um, and that is free. So, so yeah I think it needs to go on high for about three to four hours. So 
I'll either show it you tonight or I'll show you tomorrow, which I'll probably have it for breakfast anyway. So, so yeah, so that's a roulade done and a rice pudding going to be cooked as well. I also made this fruit cake as well today um, for the family, my husband's lunchbox. So, yeah, it's been a super productive day. So, this is the chicken fajitas now dished up. So, in there is the chicken, there's two peppers, two onions, um, and the JD seasonings. And then I've got some boiled rice with it and a pile of iceberg lettuce. So, my tea is free and speed. And apparently it's delicious, so I can't wait to tuck in. Well, you're going to have to excuse the state of me tonight. I've got wet so many times. I I hung washing out and then it absolutely poured down, so I had to run and get that in. Then I was out with Daisy, I got wet. Then I um, go into the car to take the kids to karate, I got wet. So I've just got wet so many times today. And I haven't showered yet, so... Um, anyway, I've had such a super busy day today, very productive day as well, but I feel absolutely exhausted now, so I just cannot wait to sit down and uh, chillax, so I'm going to try and catch up. I've caught up with a bit of YouTube since I've been back off holiday, um, you know, the the odd one, but there's a few that um, that I haven't watched, but then there's new ones coming out, and then you kind of miss some of them so anyway I'm just going to try and catch up as best as I can so yeah so I have had a busy day um it was my first proper day to do some proper housework um now the kids have gone back to school because we were so busy through the holidays well one thing and another um you know it was just it never had like a proper what I call a proper clean so today it has had the proper clean and I feel so much better for it because I'm, I hate, it wasn't muddly, but I could see, you know, dust and, and we live, we've got trees behind us, um, and quite a busy road as well. So obviously with both of those things, it does cause quite a lot of, um, dust in the house. So it was yeah it was dusty but I feel so much better now I've done it I feel absolutely knackered um probably won't be able to move later because if you've been following me for a while you know that I do suffer with a lot of arthritis and different things so sometimes overdoing it can cause a problem but hopefully not um yeah so and also I've got the rice pudding still cooking in the slow cooker it's not thickening up at the moment, so I think I might take the lid off um, because sometimes it thickens up better that way. So I might do that shortly. Um, I made the roulade that you saw. So that is nice. Oh, excuse me. To be able to have. Um, in fact, I might have a little bit now for my supper. I'll talk to you about that in a minute. Um, and I made that fruit cake for the family uh plus everything else that i've done and cooked tea done the kids lunch boxes and the husband's lunch box so it's all go 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 um yeah but i do feel so much better now that i've got the cleaning done so so today um my overnight oats was delicious that was one and a half sins for the yogurt and then I had that bacon and egg and tomatoes and mushrooms for lunch. Um, and then the orange and a Muller Light for half a sin. And that tea was absolutely gorgeous. They all thoroughly enjoyed that. So that was a, that was a winner and definitely be doing that again. Um, so that was totally sin free. Um, and throughout the day I have had a banana. I've had an apple. I had, I think I filmed it, if I haven't, then I'm telling no, but I'm pretty sure I did film it, a high five bar when I had a coffee this afternoon, so that was three sins, so, so far I'm on uh, five sins, so I was in and are about to have a skinny whip and I thought, no, I think I'm going to have the roulade because that's there and that's going to be sin free, um, 
as I explained to you earlier. So I think I'm going to have some of that. I'm going to have a slice of roulade and then I'm going to add some more strawberries. I'll have a, like a side portion of strawberries. And I've got a few blueberries as well that need eating. So I'll have those. I went to buy some blueberries this afternoon in um, Waitrose, which is my like local supermarket. And God, they're dear in there. So I didn't buy any there. So I'll have to stock up Monday when I go to Aldi. So um, I can't remember how much they were in Waitrose. But I think it was a little one of those little tiny punnets. £2.30 and I thought I'm not paying that, that's a crazy price. Oh my gosh, it's so, so sad about the Queen, absolutely gutted. Oh, so emotional earlier and um, speaking to my mum because my mum is 81. So obviously my mum's, you know, known her all her life, if you know what I mean. Um, so my mum was really upset on the phone. So very, very sad day indeed. Um, yeah, so when I come back from picking the kids up from Clarty, there was a huge bright new moon and it just sort of like, I don't know, sent shivers and silly, I know, but I just thought of the Queen and then there was this bright big full new moon and it was just beautiful seeing that moon like that, but yeah, a very sad day. Um, anyway, so yeah, that is the end of my day and I feel super good I feel like um, I've had another great day on plan and that's it all I've got to say I think so really looking forward to having some rice pudding um, I think that would be my breakfast in the morning actually so yeah I'm gonna go now and I'm gonna take the lid off and hopefully it'll all thicken up nicely and then I can portion it up um, and then I can, yeah, sort it out from there. Why I'm telling you all this, I don't know. But anyway, thank you so much for watching again. I uh, really, really appreciate all your support and all your lovely comments. God, I look really tired and I feel really tired. So I will catch you all again tomorrow. Take care. Bye.